Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, and today in this video I'm gonna talk about new Windows version, which is 22478. If you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe. So, let's begin. Today Microsoft released Windows 11 Insider Preview Build 22478 to the dev channel. Also Microsoft is celebrating 7th anniversary of Windows Insider program, and on this occasion, to celebrate the anniversary this year, Microsoft released special desktop backgrounds designed by the Microsoft design team, to show off being Microsoft and Windows 11 fans. You can download both the wallpapers, from link down below. Talking about this release, it comes with new fluent emoji. Back in July, the Microsoft design team announced refreshed and new fluent designed emoji that would roll out across all of Microsoft 365, including Windows. You can now access new fluent images by pressing Windows plus dot key on your keyboard. Microsoft also made some small adjustments to the dialog when adding a new language and settings to make it look a little more modern, including rounding the corners. Microsoft also added a feature to log in your PC when your laptop is closed, it's now possible to log into your PC using facial recognition by using Windows Hello on a connected external monitor if it has a camera attached that supports it. The updated version of the Korean IME, which began rolling out with build 22454, is now available to everyone in the dev channel. Microsoft also made a change to the underlying indexer platform to help improve overall reliability and database size, which should help reduce disk space usage on the system, particularly in cases where users had very large Outlook mailboxes. Microsoft also made some changes with volume adjustments, scrolling your mouse wheel on the volume icon in the taskbar will now change the current volume level. So, that was all major updates and features that was related to this particular new build. It also does have some additional improvements, about which you can read from the official Microsoft blog. Link to the blog is under video description. So, that was it. Hope it was useful. Consider like for the video, subscribe to the channel, and if you have any question, just comment down below. Thanks for watching, and have a great day ahead.